Outside. Had a little stroll out a minute ago and uh, did a little panoramic, but yeah, amazing. Should be a good day's walking. Had a really good night's sleep last night. I think we went to bed about maybe ten, uh, half ten ish, something like that, quarter to eleven. I woke up about seven. So, yeah, fully recharged for the day's walking. It's beautiful this morning and all. Absolutely beautiful. I think we had a tiny little shower in the night, but nothing major at all. And now it's back to glorious sunshine, so we're just making some brews now. And uh, we'll have some food and get on his way. Back to Fort William. So I'll come back to you in a bit, guys, when we uh, either on his way or doing something equally cool. See you in a bit. Right, so we have a turbo coffee to start us off this morning. Yes. We'll put four of them in. <laughs> About 18 sugars. <laughs> Should get us going, Harry. Definitely. Nice. Can't be the coffee in the morning, can you? Kick it. Not questioning race pre walk workout, but. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, Could have gone bad. Could have gone bad. Keep filming. I'm good to. It may still. It may still. Ray might lose a few teeth for this, right? Oh, look at oh, that. I'll manage that. You'll lose some teeth and qualify for Jeremy Kyle. <laughs> he loves a bit of jazz. Lunges. Let's do this in the morning. Thrust. <laughs> oh, I'm not going to leave phone in your pocket though. Oh, Christ, that nearly split the difference. <laughs> and uh, good idea there, getting a nice sweep. We're going to leave it as we find it. Do better body. than we find it, to be honest. Yeah. Do my bet for the body. The fire burnt out, so I've left the wood that didn't burn in the fireplace. So we'll make this that next time. Yes. Me and David want the form in here, watching it, how much it go down. <laughs> Come on, boys. Keep doing that, you can have a, a chocolate chip cookie. If Alan's watching, which he will be, we we'll sweep it up and put it in the bin. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Right then guys, uh, here we are, all geared up and ready to rock. Another beautiful day walking in the old West Islands. It looks a beautiful day, doesn't it, lads? It certainly it's does. Gorgeous. It's great. It's going to be a good day. Right, about another 12 and a half, 13 mile, possibly 28 mile. <laughs> 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 right, see you in a bit. What a beautiful bloody morning, isn't it? Yeah. Lovely, isn't it? Oh, really it's really nice. Nice. There's a slightly different view of the old derelict house and then the barn. The barn is where we stayed the second time we did this walk. There were a man and the, his wife in the bothy. <laughs> so we crossed the river and chowed down the barn, which is uh, similar to a bothy, just got like a flat concrete floor in it. But the bothy is much nicer. Right, onwards, back more through this bog. Just a little stop to fill the water bottles up. Good stuff, tastes nice as well. Tastes nice, mate, yeah. That. Fast flowing over rocks, then it should be good. No sediment. No nothing. No, uh, <laughs> no, uh, no tap balls. Aquatic life this yeah. time. Absolutely stunning. A beautiful morning, man. It's worth a few aches and pains. Carrying all your gear. To get all that stuff in. Give 
you know, just check the uh, route on the map. Looks like we're going to have a little river crossing here instead of further down. Maybe shave a little bit off. I think I'm just going to do it in my boots. Try and find the right rocks. Well, it's good to go either way. <laughs> and I was going to film this big, so I want to drop my phone. I'll race fast in the bridge. Go on, Ray, a few more like that, mate. <laughs> it's not very wide here. It's not very deep either. Me and Dave just went for it and got slightly wet boots. Yes. Well, not too bad. It's They'll be all right. Boots, that's all. Ray is no way getting his brand new walking boots even slightly wet, he no. says. So I think he's going to fashion a bridge. <laughs> what you reckon to do? He'll make a bridge, won't he? Yeah. It'll be like the bridge over the River Kwai. Yeah. <laughs> we need Alistair. We do need Alistair. Yeah. Alistair will fashion a bridge. The Colossus. Ray, come here where it's shallow. It's better than falling in all together, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> it's only two inch deep, man. Get on. <laughs> oh, that's a bad mistake, Ray. <laughs> that could have gone bad. Speed this up in video, I think you're taking that long. <laughs> yeah, but I think I'll do it. He's like a professional. Stop, stop my top of boots, really. Is it? Ah, bring down my boot then. Oh, that's it. <laughs> Mission accomplished, mate. Ah. Right, that's it. He's going home. I think we're walking about an hour or so. Come quite a distance already. Okay, slight delay there as I was walking down this uh, slippy old path. Slipped and uh, split me difference. <laughs> so I've got a big rip between my legs on my trousers. Luckily, I bought my spare crag off for once. That'd have been bad, Ray, if I didn't have the spares. <laughs> I'd have been, uh, been boxer shorts all the way, mate. <laughs> all right, back to it. <laughs> An absolutely rubbish place you picked on break. Yeah, it's terrible, isn't it? <laughs> terrible that. Well, <laughs> it's not bad, is it? There we go, guys. Nice shot of Ben Nevis from the other side. We're gonna walk right down there and around it. Hope you can hear me because of the wind. <laughs> oh my god. a lot better going than the bog and it comes with an amazing view as well yeah the rope bridge if I remember is not too far from the car park so you get a lot of day visitors on this bit so I might see a few more people but pretty much the only person we've seen on the whole walk is an old guy from South Africa a few miles ago he's walking the opposite route that we've just done fair play to him he's doing it on his own as well
first time we did this walk, we ended up here, but we ended up going to cross it, so we just crossed the river there and got it from the other side. Those bags weighed about 25 kilograms, and let me tell you, that's is no easy task balancing over that with your 25 kilograms on your back. Still did it though. Good fun. Without risk of getting absolutely soaked if you fall. Final break time before we do the five mile stretch back to Fort Bill. I think Nino's going to attempt the uh, the wire bridge though. I'm not going to attempt it, I'm going to conquer it. You're going to conquer it, yeah. I've I've no done attempt it. at all. I know I'm using this excuse, but I've done it twice, so I'm going to leave it today. We don't have to cross it, obviously, we're going, we're walking down there. It's just for fun. This is pure for fun. Thank goodness. Uh, yeah, I, I just said a minute ago when we did it before, we did it with like 25 kg, kilogram bags on. Yeah, that was rather idiotic, and I remember not going right to the end there, like swinging yeah. off the thing and then dropping. That was stupid, about ripping hands off. Yeah. The second you get on it, it's fine if you're on your own. The second another person gets on it, that bottom foot cable was crazy. And because we're like really good friends, Obviously, we're trying to rock it while the other one's going to cross. Yeah, why would you not? That's what best friends do. Yeah. It's uh, it's got a little bit shallower, I think. So. And we all. And we all. Right, I'll let you go with you now. I am going to film it. You take your time, Dino. There's no pressure. Never pressure. Never. The one-armed filming thing were a bad idea. <laughs> the one-handed one filming. One hand, hand on the thing. <laughs> Get a little tweak, Ray. That's definitely not deep enough for wild swimming either. No, no. Accomplished. Nice one, Dino. I don't like Go on, Ray. Big in the car park now for the final furlong of that rocky section down the valley were a tad longer than I remembered. In my head I thought it were about maybe a couple of minutes, in reality it's more like half an hour. It all adds to the fun. So that spectacular place we've just been is Steel Gorge and Waterfall. Really beautiful. Worth the walk. Okay then fellas, that's the uh, tricky part done. That's <laughs> the undulating terrain done with. Dave's just chilling out and being it. Raise your stains of Blue aid. So now it's just back to regular road business for five miles, I'll say. Five miles back to the campsite. Yeah, should be easy. Oh, we'll get out of the way, oh, oh, quick. Oh, oh. Go, go, go. Approaching Glen Nevis campsite now, about half a mile away till the end of the walk. This last uh, five miles so has been a bit of a, yes, a, bit, harsh the feet. a bit of an ankle thrasher, yeah. <laughs> especially when you're a bit achy from doing all the miles. Like I said before, it's it's been longer because of the amount of bogs, the up here down here, jump in the gaps and the streams and the sinking. And uh, but yeah, it's all part of it, isn't it. It's all good fun. So the plan now is to get back. Get showered, get changed, and go out and have haggis, neeps and tatties, and the grog and gruel. That's what we've been looking forward to. <laughs> but, good little accomplishment. Take a good time, Rennie. Yes, we're doing 
weather, as usual. You can't beat it, mate, can you? It's getting a little bit windy now, isn't it? Yeah. It's a nice weather always. It's just starting to get a little bit How's the slog? Time for a shower. Good morning, guys. It's now Tuesday morning. I've well, just woke up and got uh, showered and stuff, and it is the last day of the trip today. I finished the walk yesterday, obviously. Uh, went out to Fort William and had haggis and just a couple of drinks, nothing major because we're all a bit tired from the walk. So I came back to get his head down and uh, today Dino suggested that instead of going straight back to Derbyshire we're going to go via Edinburgh. Uh, so yeah, we're going to have see a few sats around Edinburgh, have some dinner there and then head on back to sunny Derbyshire. So it should be a good day. Probably get going guys because it's a bit windy here and I don't know if you can hear me or not. So I'll catch you in a bit. So a bit of rain is due, I think. Rain is massively stopping play at the minute, isn't it? So, uh, it's a quick call up at Subway. I think it's not going to stop though. Right, good afternoon guys. Back again. The Edinburgh tour was a bit of a non-event. We got there and it were absolutely peeing it down. And we are getting soaked, so we didn't even get to see the castle or take any pictures. Couldn't do any filming or anything. Unfortunately, so we just had a subway and uh, then tram back home. Dino, bless him, just done all the driving. Cheers, Dino. Never a problem. Much appreciated, buddy. David's been working, man, hasn't it? That was a weekend that'll live long in the memory. Yeah. Great. Yeah, that's a journey, please. So, thanks everyone if you've watched this far. Thanks for liking, subscribing, and commenting. And I'll catch you all very soon. See you later. See you later.